Hey, what's going on everybody? For this video, I've got three mystery packs from Walgreens from your friends at the Fairfield Company. They had a bunch of these hanging on the shelf at Walgreens and I have not seen these yet. Brand new mystery pack says you get three baseball packs inside. Hopefully they're not like 91 Fleer or 90 Fleer even though I do enjoy opening that stuff. Um, hopefully that's not what it's full of. I'm, I don't know. I'm going to, I'm going to guess what's inside here. And like I said, I don't know. I have never, I have not seen these before. I have no idea what is in here, what could be in here. I'm going to guess based off what's been in recent Walgreens boxes that we've had, uh, like 2020 heritage high number, maybe some 2022 top series one retail pack, something along those lines, maybe some like 2019 heritage. I don't know, something like that. That's what I'm guessing, but I honestly don't know. So these were hanging, they were hanging, they said $9.99 a piece, which I thought wasn't, you know, considering it's not horrible, I guess, but they rang up $12.99. I guess they were just hanging in the, the wrong spot. There wasn't anything back there that said $12.99, but so I just, I, I bought them and uh, we'll see. We'll see what's inside each of these. thought I'd get three of them. If I get three of them, it'll give us a good taste of maybe what's inside of each of these. If we look at the back, it says this package is guaranteed to contain three baseball packs. One and four contain a hit. A hit may include a game used card. We've got an autograph, a relic, and there's some Gorilla Glue or something on there holding these things together here, but... Let's see what is going to be. I'm just going to rip it down the side here. And let's see what's inside the first pack. Let's see, can we get a hit of some sort? Hopefully there's some, you know, a decent pack in here. And inside of our first pack, we have, well, that's not baseball. That is not baseball. That is ludicrous. We do have a four card pack here of Topps Chrome. Looks like it's probably, I guess it's probably from a blaster box. And we have some 2022 opening day. So this is stupid. It, I mean, it clearly says right here, three baseball packs. And they're putting in 1991 Pro Set Platinum Series 2. I have no clue. I guess we'll open it up. I have no clue what's going to be in here. Obviously, there's going to be some football cards. And uh, I don't know. Let's, uh, it's kind of weird. Let's see. No name, Jay Schrader. All right. I honestly, I don't even, I'm not going to know a lot of these guys. I mean, I collected a little bit of football, but... Stefan Page, is that what that says? Stefan Page, yeah, okay. Um, I'm not sure. Steve Jordan, some of the bigger guys, the main guys, I'll probably know. I don't know who that is. Is that, uh, I don't know, is that, that's not Dan McGuire, is that, I don't know when he started. Yeah, it is Dan McGuire. Dan McGuire. I sure hope there's not one of these in, uh, The uh, other boxes be kind of aggravating. Henry Jones I'm trying to be pretty positive with you know what I what I opened. Todd Marinovich, Ricky Irvin, and Carl Banks. So that was kind of trashy right there. But when you don't, when it says you're getting, when it says you're getting baseball packs and you get a football pack, yeah. All right, let's see if we can get lucky out of here and hit something amazing out of this opening day pack. No, we got the Mariner Moose. Oh, look at that. We actually did hit something kind of rare. Luck of the Irish is we got a Scherzer and a Trey Ambergy rookie. But these are actually... Those are actually pretty rare hits. Luck of Those Luck of the Irish cards, those are kind of short prints so let's see let's see if we can find it on the back here because i know the odds are fairly long of hitting one of those luck of the irish cards printing plates 
Walk this way. Luck of the Irish. Insert one in six hundred ninety. One in one thousand six hundred ninety-eight packs. So we're looking at one in seventeen hundred odds of hitting a Luck of the Irish card out of a random opening day pack. That's uh, it's pretty cool. And Jesse Winker. I mean, I think most people, if they're going to hit a long odd card like that, that they may choose somebody. Besides Jesse Winker, I'm sure there's lots of Jesse Winker fans, but in either way, that is a pretty darn cool card to hit out of one random pack of tops opening day. So, I don't know. Pro Line 91, maybe you'll uh, maybe this will make up for it. Who knows? So we got a pack here of Tops Chrome 2022. I don't know. I don't remember if the light boxes said Hobby on it, had the H for the Hobby on it or not. I don't remember, but. Uh, We'll see here, and it's a five card pack, so it looks like it's probably out of a blaster box. So let's see what we got here. Nick Castellanos, there's a Rodolfo Castro rookie, Pete Alonzo, new, what is that, new classics. We got a Max Kranick rookie, and then we have a Sepia Mookie Betts. So this is from a blaster box, because the blaster box has had the Sepia and the uh, pink Parallel. So, first pa first uh, mystery box, not too bad. I mean, that saved it. Having the NFL pack in it, I don't know. That's got to be a mistake. It's kind of screwy if you ask me. But All right, let's see. Let's hope we don't have an NFL pack in this one. And we have a hit in this one. I can feel it. I can feel a hit of some sort, and it's just sitting in there. Not sleeved or anything, but you can see it sitting back there. So let's uh, let's check out our packs. We got a pack of opening day again. We have, oh, Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary. That's a cool one. And another NFL pack. That would be flipping kidding me. And check that out. It's a manufactured patch. World Series MVP David Freeze. That is is actually a pretty cool card. I mean, St. Louis Cardinals, the hometown team. Man, that World Series in 2011, the greatest game. It's, I mean, in my opinion, maybe it's just because it's the Cardinals, but the greatest World Series game of all time right there. 2011, down to their last strike, David Freeze hits the... Uh, triple to clear the bases to uh, score the tying run. Oh my god! So I'm gonna put that up there. So we did get a hit. We did get another stinking NFL platinum pack in there. So let's open it up. I'm gonna look at the back so I can see the names, and then we'll check out the fronts if we get anybody good. Jeff Herod. Or if we get anything good, I don't know. I don't think these are anything too great. I'm not sure. Pretty sure Brett Favre's rookie cards in 91, but it's a junior Seau. Brett Favre's rookie's in 91. I don't know if it's in this set or not. If it's in Series 1 or Series 2. John Freeze, Anthony Miller, and Mark Carrier. So, not a junior Seau in there. Not too bad. Nothing too interesting. I love this Topps Chrome Platinum. That's a cool one. Cool set. Looks like it's probably, it's blue. I don't know. It looks like it's probably out of like a mega box or something. All right, let's see if we can get lucky in this opening day pack. Maybe we'll get something else. Maybe we'll get one of those dugout peaks or something like that. There's Screech. Ozzy Albies. And that's it. Nothing else happening in there. Let's check out this Platinum Anniversary pack. Pulled a couple of nice cards out of these. 1952 design. We got, it looks like we got an all base pack in here. We got Tarek Skubal, Trevor Hoffman, Merrill Kelly, and Mark Burley. So they just did announce, I just saw they're going to have like coming out next month, I want to say, sometime in March. They're going to bring this back again. They're doing a uh, platinum anniversary and they're going to move up to the 1953 tops design with that one which would be cool 2022 it'll have bobby and j-rod and torkelson and it'll have jeremy pena it'll have all those guys in there so all right last one 
I expect the same. And another another NFL pack. That's and they're sticking together. Another NFL pack, another Topps Chrome out of a blaster box, and another opening day. So for $12.99 a piece, what these rang up to. I don't know. Hey, and look at that. Look at that. Brett Favre, Platinum Prospect. Check it out. There we go. Brett Favre rookie card. So random NFL packs. Paying off right now. NFL packs in a baseball product. We hit ourselves a Brett Favre Platinum Prospect rookie card. Sure, that's not too rare, but Nick Bell, we got Vaughn Johnson. Who else we got going on in here? Wendell Davis. They are sticky a little bit. Bill Brooks, no relation. Dan, some blah, 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 something. Oh, sticking together here. Alfred Williams. Who else is in here? Gil Bird. Bryce, is that Bryce Pop? Chris Dickinson, and I think there's one more behind here. It is Mark Carrier. So, we got a Brett Favre rookie card. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? Brett Favre rookie, David Freeze patch, Jesse Winker, Luck of the Irish, Super short print card there, one out of like 1,700 packs. Let's check out this opening day pack here. There's an A-Rod Bomb Squad, and that's all we got going on in there. And our final pack is going to be this Topps Chrome. Let's see if we can get lucky with another random, one random blaster box pack. Anything thick in there going on? Doesn't look like it. So we got Yastrzemski, we got Michael Brantley. Tim Anderson, and another Jesse Winker. So, there you go. What do you think? This is like 30, close to $40 worth of uh, the packs when you uh, get down to it. But did get hit, you know, got one and four. We got our hit, nice manufactured patch. I like that one. A pretty rare um, insert there. Brett Favre rookie card. Kind of ridiculous, though. Three baseball packs and... Three of the packs were football. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. So, what would you give this product? What would Daryl Strawberry give this product? I mean, we got really lucky. We got really lucky hitting that card. Um, Value-wise, I mean, we did get some chrome. We did get some... Uh, yeah, no, what else? So we got that platinum anniversary. So, it could be a lot worse. Um, give it an edible strawberry. We'll just say this is kind of a, it was, it was okay. I had a lot worse packs. The packs were slightly better than I thought they were going to be, except for the, you know, except for the football, obviously. But you guys let me know what you think about that product. Uh, what would you give it? Um, and go ahead and subscribe if you have not yet. And I promise I will catch you on the next one. See ya.